Hey yo, what's up people? So today I'll be showing you some uh, bullet holes in After Effects. Yeah. So right now I have the elements of concrete hole, powder heads, wall head front, and I have the footage of the dining room. And as you can see, the footage is a bit shaky and it's about rotating it. So uh, I already tracked motion the footage. And if you want to know how to track motion, and you can just click the video, the link right beside the f video. So yeah. Um, so let's get started. First, we're gonna do use the wall head front right here. I'm gonna make a big bigger, and I'm gonna parent that to the null object, and now you will see that it sticks on the ground. But there's a bit problem here because the if you see closely, the edges are cut out so what we're gonna do is the use the rectangle mask tool and we're gonna mask the edge right there and then we're gonna use the subtract mode and click, click mm to bring up the feather and we're just gonna blend it feather it and then also as you can see the bottom part it's also cut out here so we're gonna use the also the rectangle mask and we're just gonna mask the bottom just gonna, yeah and then subtract it and feather it so it blends anyways so that's it okay next will be actually the color we're gonna use the color correction because it doesn't match with this wall so we're gonna do effect color correction color curves and we're gonna bring down the color curves down so it's gonna match it and also we're gonna use the effect color correction levels because there's a light right here and it should be a, a bit bright right here so we're gonna use the we're just gonna play around with this a bit whatever so yeah and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna use our the the concrete hole so first we're gonna do is we're gonna f use the three frames so one two three right there four is too late so we need use three so concrete hole we're gonna drag that below the wall hits so you'll see this it's behind the wall it's and you can see that it looks really fake so you're gonna use the the electrical tool mask and we're just gonna mask it small and yeah we're, but then you can see the edges are really fake so you can just feather it out so it blends and then we're gonna uh, first we're gonna make it a bit just like kind of smaller and I'm gonna parent that to the null object. So now it sticks there. And if you want to make it more a bit realistic with this, um, I'm gonna use the powder hits, and I'm gonna drag it there. I should below behind the wall hit, and I'm gonna make this, and I'm gonna make it smaller. And we're also gonna. Uh, Use the null object parent that for powder hits. Now you'll see the this nice wall hit. And um, also, if you want to make more fancy with the wall powder hits, I'm just gonna mask the uncheck that. And we're gonna use the what for wall uh the powder hits. We're gonna go to effect color correction hue saturation and then we're gonna play around the saturation master because you want to match with this yellowish color so so right there too bright it's not good so and if I, I'm gonna bring the brightness oh if I bring it too high it's okay but yeah you just want to make it perfect so also now it's done so it's like so 
So that's pretty much it about the. And if as you can see, if it's move, it just sticks to the wall. And also you can do is motion blur it. Enable the motion blur so whenever your video is moving, it also blurs every time it moves. So it's like, as you can see, if you go closely, it blurs. So yeah thanks for watching and please subscribe